people need to embrace diversity because everyone can add value if you're willing to be open. Where are you going someday? Coffee! Jim Messimer, founder, executive director of San Francisco RBI. I was a former professional athlete and then went into healthcare and was a CEO in Silicon Valley. And I wanted to get back to my roots. I wanted to get back to sports. So reaching out to Major League Baseball and establishing a strategic alliance seemed like a natural fit. And what I wanted to do here is I wanted to uh, create more than just a solution around sports. I wanted to also create a solution around literacy for our underserved youth in San Francisco. We have a systemic problem in our schools, urban and public. So we have an opportunity to create change and create a solution around a very large problem. How often would you think that you're going to be able to learn how to read better by uh, actually playing some baseball? Education is a national priority and baseball is a great national pastime. You put the two of those together and you have the makings of a successful young person. And I believe that RBI under Jim Messimer's leadership has the potential to become a national model. San Francisco RBI brings the most mission-directed aspects of the startup world, the skills of entrepreneurs to the world of education. All of the kids San Francisco RBI serves are entrepreneurs in their very own way. I really feel that the first entrepreneur in our family was my grandfather who came from Poland through Ellis Island. English was a second language for him and he was uh, illiterate and uh, he could only sign his name to his paycheck. And his gamble as a young teenager to come here to this country benefited his children, his grandchildren, and his great-grandchildren. In a small way, he came here to help us get a better education. And my desire and goal in a way of honoring his memory was looking to provide a solution to underserved youth in San Francisco and the rest of the country where they can have educational reform and have the ability to succeed in life. Our students right now, 45% of our students at, at third grade, in third grade or reading below grade level. You can't get a student to be college or career ready if you don't start with a strong literacy background. And getting students to be literate, you know, by the third grade, reading at grade level is critically important. What I love about San Francisco RBI is the ability to use technology and to be data driven. We're going to do a needs analysis. We're going to do a retrospective look at the data in our schools. We're going to look at professional development that's been historically done. And there's a variety of different things that we're going to work on with leadership in Unified, as well as leadership in the school and the faculty as well. I think it's incredibly important. It's the old Peter Drucker, what gets measured gets done. And it's absolutely essential we don't assert ourselves, but we actually prove ourselves. We're going to do a clinical trial type study where we have embedded San Francisco RBI into this particular school and then we will compare that to like schools to see what our success ratios are. I'm managing this organization like I'd build another startup in Silicon Valley. So every dollar that we spent, we hold ourselves accountable and look at data and metrics to be able to go back to the donors in the community, especially in these difficult economic times, to show that every dollar that we spend, there's a return on investment for that dollar. And there's a variety of different organizations that we reach out to to make sure that we're not siloed. If we all bond together, we can create even a stronger solution. We believe that it's very important that we continue to invest back into our communities. And so we're always looking for that opportunity for us to give back. And when we look at this kind of a program, it's an opportunity to invest in the future. We really believe that what San Francisco RBI is trying to do in our community aligns with what we're trying to do. You know, through our 230 student athletes, they can be great ambassadors for the institution. And so going out and working with the youth in our community, we hope that eventually that leads to less problems in our community and things that we can help enhance and make San Francisco even a better place. One of the things that San Francisco RBI can do is be an incredible partner with the school district to be able to teach kids how to be respectful. Baseball is a team sport. So you have to be able to work well with other people. You have to know how to support each other and how to enhance each other's chances for success. You know what? I'm going to give this ball to your mom and dad, okay? Give this ball to your mom and dad. That's the catch of the game, okay? San Francisco RBI is really focused on the whole child, developing in them confidence, respect. All right. It's really about value-based or value-driven 
recreation. Baseball is also about making decisions. Critical thinking is a core task of literacy. Who likes to read? Me. Everybody needs to read. You know why? No. Because education is the most important no. thing for you guys. The end result, simply, we want all of our kids to read at grade level. We want them to graduate high school. We'd love for them to leverage the RBI College Scholarship Fund, go on to college and become work ready. This vision of engaging students and getting them physically active, but as well getting them intellectually active and literacy and reading at grade level is just a marriage of ideas that for us uh, totally resonates with, with our students and with our strategic plan. San Francisco RBI is a very great um, program. I really get to learn and grow and know more about softball. Kojim like inspires us to play and to be better at school and well better in life actually. My children develop uh, physically, mentally, and academically. They both shine. If I don't make it to the major league, I will always look back in San Francisco RBI and think about like what they did for me in both athletics and education. If RBI can give young people the skills to make this a better country and to create a positive future for the next generation, then they've succeeded in creating major league citizens.